Okay, Casablanca. I waited a long time to show you this movie. This is a 4K um, HDR 10 movie. Meaning that um, you're not going to get the same effect as Dolby Vision or anything. It looks pretty good, but I got to tell you... But when I looked on Blu-ray.com, I looked at, at the... Um, you know, the details they give you about all the set, um, different things like picture and video. Video, Dolby Vision wasn't that great. I mean, not Dolby Vision. The HDI 10 really wasn't that great. And um, when I looked at it, it was okay. But when people say black and white, um, it doesn't make much of a difference. It helps it out. But the HD was more than acceptable in this movie. It was a very good, clean-looking movie. And if you look at what year this was from, you gotta, you can't... Um, you can't expect much more out of it. I don't think there'll ever be a better looking um, way for this movie. Because as we keep going up, we're not going to be able to tell the difference before you know it. Damn it. Just won't give me a year. I know it was, I know it was 1940-something this movie was made in. I can't, can you believe it? This is ridiculous. Um, 2022 is when they made the Blu-ray. I don't care about that. Wow. Well, let's, just, let's just ask Siri if Siri is smart enough. Casablanca. Wow. It showed me the White House. <laughs> That's how dumb Siri is. Okay. Uh, Casablanca the movie. Here's what I found. Now, I can pick this up, but when I say Casablanca, it brings me to the White House. That's ridiculous. Um, 1942. This movie's not going to look much better than it ever um, than it does now. Actually, I don't think it ever will. What can they do? You can keep upgrading the pixels, but if nobody can tell the difference, what's the point in even doing that? Um, so, resolution-wise, I don't think it's ever going to be touched again. I don't see the point in doing that. That doesn't sound right. Well, all right. Bye-bye.